Let's take a look at two different American industries. In 2016, one created almost 400,000 jobs. The other, less than half that many. One grew 12 times faster than the rest of the economy. The other had negligible growth. One produces a clean output. The other pollutes our air, contaminates our water, and heats our planet. Which industry do you think we should be embracing as a country? Yeah, me too. And yet, nearly every day, we hear that the transition from fossil fuel to sun and wind will be job-killing or bad for the economy. Let's take a closer look at that claim and see if it holds up. Renewable energy jobs exist all over the country. Compare that to the fossil fuel industry. It's focused in just a few states. When we support renewable energy, we're also supporting small businesses. 70% of Americans who work in energy efficiency and renewables are in companies with 10 employees or fewer. Finally, renewable energy creates American jobs on American soil. High-paying construction, installation, maintenance jobs. And they don't get outsourced to oil fields around the world, they stay right here at home. Now, I'm not going to pretend that moving from fossil fuels to renewables won't cost real people real jobs, especially in certain parts of the country. But the solution to that problem isn't to keep propping up an industry that's not only declining, but killing our planet on the way out. That's why America needs to invest in those workers with training programs to help them transition in the same way that America is transitioning, away from fossil fuel to renewable energy sources. Those are the facts. The claim that renewable energy is a job killer or a drain on our economy is a myth perpetuated by the fossil fuel industry and the politicians who do its bidding. In reality, renewable energy is creating hundreds of thousands of jobs all across America.